desirable, well-dressed group you are. <laughs> um, I think the hardest part of being a musician is set it, writing a set list because, um, well, there's many layers to writing of a set list, and the first one that makes it quite difficult is when you have to write it with four other people. And um, if I was a solo musician, I suppose I probably would just get up and write the set list as I went along. And I'm, um, I'm the kind of person that wants everyone to always like me, so I would probably spend most of the set being like, What did you say? What? Which song? I can't play that one. I'm sorry, which one? And then everybody in the audience would be like, Just play something! And, um, and so that's the first part of the problem when you're writing a set list, is that when you're like me, you're worried about... Um, oh, oh, Aunt Nancy. Aunt Nancy. Okay, it's okay. It doesn't bother me. They can yell, that's okay. So anyway, the first part of it is, is that I worry that I'm going to displease people. Is that a word, displease? Yes. I feel like, I'll feel like you'll go home and you'll be like, that damn Tegan, she didn't play any of the songs I wanted. The second part is trying to please Sarah because, um, because there's lots of songs that she doesn't like to play or that I don't like to play, so we have to negotiate between Sarah, the two of us. And the third part, Sarah is fit. That joke never gets old in our band, by the way. And the third part of writing a set list that makes it really hard is, is that there's got to be some natural flow. And, um, and so we thought it would be really funny to put Are You Ten Years Ago, which is arguably the, the heaviest song next to Soil Soil, which is like the wussiest, girliest song ever. So did you enjoy that? It also, it, it ends the very intense, melodramatic section of the set. And now we're going to enter the oldies section. And, uh, and so we encourage, we encourage a lot of singing along. If you want to yell, you can, but you can also sing. This is your moment to shine. We've got, we've got hidden cameras everywhere from Britain's American Idol. I mean, Britain's top idol, the singing idol championship, Britain style. And they'll be watching you, so sing your heart out because you could be the next person to sell no records.